Long story short, pulse cycle therapy is going to suck balls. You're going to lose muscle. You're going to look smaller. Perhaps you're going to get fatter in the process. You're certainly going to look a lot less cosmetically appealing. This God mode is slowly going to go away and you're going to feel like a normal and mortal human being again. You stop anabolic androgenic steroid administrations, allowing them to completely metabolize from the body. So if you're running Tremblone or Nandrolone or Mint or anything else that's highly potent and highly suppressive, let those metabolize while you're following a testosterone replacement therapy bridge. You're going to run that as the other steroids are metabolizing from your system, allowing you to acclimatize to this endogenous testosterone concentration in the bloodstream. When you feel all of the other steroids have metabolized, you're going to stop testosterone and wait for hormone levels to decline to basically zero to the point you feel like a little girl because then everything has metabolized from your system. There's no negative feedback. At this point, you would start ACG to restore testicular function unless you were already using ACG on cycle, in which case you would simply continue with the ACG until you're ready to start with selective estrogen receptor modulators. And these dosages are going to taper down over a period of four or maybe even six weeks. 